Every day I struggle with being a hardcore Los Angeles Lakers fan and on the reverse side being a LeBron James hater. I just don't like him. I don't really want him on the team. I wish he never signed with the Lakers. I don't care if we do go to the playoffs. I would rather LeBron James not be on the Lakers and us miss the playoffs for the next five years and build up with the young guys that we have, except having this fucking clown on our team. Anyways, um, he, sub- he said something really stupid I just wanted to touch on really quick. So he basically made a comment comparing uh, NFL owners mentality uh, with that um, what, of them having a slave mentality a slavery mentality them being the slave owners and their teams being the plantation <laughs> you know when people compare uh, horrible times in our country's past or in the world's past with uh, what their social justice weenie problems of today you you really take away from the historical significance of said past uh, actions for instance when democrats compare uh the migrant people at the border trying to get in with uh escaping nazi Germ- germany when the jews were escaping uh the gestapo when you make stupid comparisons like that when you try to compare uh, millionaires or billionaires paying millionaires to play a game that me and you and our friends played as children in the street uh, when you compare that to 400 years of black people being whipped raped, killed uh, not being allowed to learn, learn how to read learn how to write um sometimes not even able to learn about religion Um, the constant fear when you try to escape your owner's plantation and knowing that if you get caught you're going to get 40 lashes Uh, you're going to get you might get sold away from your family away from your children and you might never ever ever see them again that when you compare it to an, an NFL football player who can't decide between buying a new Porsche or if he should just get that ugly, boxy-looking Mercedes-Benz SUV. You take away from what slavery was, which was a very dark, dark part of our nation's history. So, it's stupid shit like that that LeBron says that really gets on my nerves. So, if I were the uh, head of the Los Angeles Lakers, I would trade this guy. Just because I I just don't want, I don't want the drama. I don't want the headaches. I don't want somebody on my team complaining about millionaires being treated like slaves. So, hey, at the end of the day, if you don't want to play football, if you don't want to work under the collective bargaining agreement that was agreed upon between players and owners, if you don't want to play football, you don't have to. No one's uh, forcing you to play football. Quit. Go get a job at Ikea. Hey, you could take my job. You could take this shitty job. This job sucks. So did this company. Everyone that works here is depressed. You should see the break room. It's really sad here. (laughs) Uh, Two more weeks I'm out here, guys. All right. Catch up with you later. Peace out.